All right, I just got back to the office and just checking on my print. It said it's finished. Build time was 10 hours and 12 minutes. I predicted it to be 13 hours um, because I printed something similar, which is this. Um, and it's just an office organizer type of thing. Anyway, that right there, which has been printed, does not look anything like this. Um, and so to suspect uh, the cause of this is going to be, let's see, uh, okay, so this is where the filament goes into, and this is the filament, uh, this plastic PLA, it's a, it's a, a material made from corn, um, but it gets fed into, let's see here, just like this, and into this hole right there. Well, when it snaps off, and sometimes it does because of some sort of, I guess, temperature issues or if you stored it incorrectly for a long time, but uh, this has a tendency to become brittle. So I'll show you guys. I just snapped this off. Uh, I mean, with, you know, barely a tug. So, let's see, there you go. So I think that uh, this has kind of gone bad uh, or it's not worthy to print because obviously it broke off here and then the print just kept going and the machine assumed that there was filament being fed in and ultimately spat out this end right here and um, printing layer by layer on here. So we got a partial print, that's what it looks like. Uh, I'm gonna have to just pretty much rip it off um, and uh, try again if I wanna occupy this printer for 10 hours. Um, other than that, that's uh, one of the perils of 3D printing is that you're going to have a lot of uh, byproduct and waste. Um, as you can see my waste bin here, um, it's, it's pretty terrible. Um, you got stringy stuff whenever um, it just starts spitting out, just, you know, it just starts printing on top of it, uh, you know, something that doesn't have supports. Um, these are supports. This is a half print that uh, happened a while back. It was, uh, uh, it was, uh, I think it was some sort of a uh, gumball machine, I believe. Um, and yeah, this is the back side of it. So you'll get, oh, you'll get a lot of these. Um, what I want to do in the future, or I want somebody to do, is be able to take this uh, and remanufacture or re-spool it back into um, stringy, uh, you know, ropey type of material like this, and then we can reuse it. Um, but, you know, obviously plastic degrades, uh, especially after heating it over and over. Um, that's why you can't recycle things more than a few times. So, um, I'm not sure if this is recyclable, but if there is a way uh, I'm sure it'll be out pretty soon because I'm sure I'm not the only one that's facing this issue or that issue right there. So anyway guys, um, and you know, this is just one of many videos. Check out my page. There's a lot of uh, random things on there. Uh, give this video a like if you like 3D printing. Thanks.